How's everyone doing? Today I'm going to be opening up some 2022 Mosaic Football. I've got a blaster box, I've got a cello pack, and a hanger pack. So one each. I'm going to test them out and see how they do against each other. Uh, obviously the blaster box is more money. This goes for 30 Um the hanger pack, I believe, is 20, and then the cello pack is 15 uh, at Target. So let me know if you've opened up any of the Mosaic 2022 football cards uh, and what you think is the best, the cello, the hanger, or the blaster, which format. And let me know what the best card you got uh, has been. And let me know who your favorite uh, player is right now for football and your favorite player all time for football. Leave me those comments down below. But now let's go ahead and get into it and open up these 2022 Mosaic football cards. Let's check them out. All right, here we go. So a bit of a format war, format battle, if you will. Uh, again, a, a blaster, a hanger, and a cello. And let's see uh, which is the best. Although it's a bit unfair because this, again, is 30 bucks. That's 20 that's 15 You really, like, if you're going to do price-wise, maybe you do uh, two of these versus that. And this... Uh, a little bit closer, but still not the same value. Um, and you're looking for the inserts, Genesis, Honeycomb. You got the new Razzle Dazzle in here. Uh, any of the fluorescents. I think this one has the blue. I think this is the only product that has the blue. Uh, you can see right there some of the other different uh, inserts and things in there. So, And then you have the different uh, parallels. This one has three exclusive mosaic uh, camo pink parallels and then one other mosaic parallel and then uh, i've got the hangers right here which i uh, find four hanger pack exclusive mosaic reactive orange parallels and i believe there's like a usually an orange rookie in there too so that's always a positive and then for the blaster right here I'm trying to say yeah here we go the retail exclusive autographs and scripts and rookie scripts look for blaster exclusive mosaic orange fluorescent parallels and Mac Jones. I remember that one card right before the season started went for uh, somebody sold it for a hundred thousand dollars for Mac Jones. And then that person flipped it for 175,000. Now that same card, uh, nowhere near that value after this season. <laughs> uh, but here you go. Here's some more cards that you can get in there. Um, I wish it would give you the odds for the cards. It tells you like randomly inserted and then, you know, what they're numbered to and things like that. You know, you get storm chasers in here too. Um, you get uh, the busted, you get stained glass, all kinds of good stuff. This is definitely my favorite football product and they juice these up even more. Some more cool inserts and stuff like that. Um, and I think retail is better than hobby for this. So wish me luck. Um, the championship games just ended. And uh, it is a bit of a shame uh, for the 49ers. They didn't really get any chance. I mean, four quarterbacks they went through injured. Um, so that is a bit of a bummer. You can't really win without a quarterback. You got Chris McCaffrey trying to throw out there. He did throw a touchdown this year. Um, but still, you don't want your running back to do that. Uh, you know, it's essentially the last resort. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to open up um, the cello pack first, actually. So let's go ahead and get into it. This is the one where you have the pink camos. But let me know, who do you think is going to win the Super Bowl? Mahomes again or the Eagles? I hear a lot of people talking about the Eagles are going to destroy them, but I don't know. Um, I remember when... The Commanders went in and destroyed them and destroyed uh, the Cowboys. They should have been in for the playoffs. They got completely robbed in that Giants game. Um, and they could have managed to... Do, you know, I'd rather see the Commanders lose than the Eagles win. <laughs> uh, I know. Just uh, some NFC East hate. But wish me luck on here. Um, I've seen... I've been in some breaks recently, too. Uh, I've seen some great things pulled, some autos. I'd love to get an auto um, or Genesis. I've opened up so much product uh, trying to get, you know, the big hits, Kabooms, Downtowns for uh, different products and stuff like that. You know, of course, uh, Optic, um, that's a big one too. But I, Mosaic to me, I always love all the different cool parallels, but I've yet to pull a Genesis or a Honeycomb. I've purchased um, a Honeycomb before, but all right, hopefully 
It doesn't look like it in this pack, but let's see what we got. Davis Mills, Justin Fields, Clinton Portis, uh, Devontae Smith, Josh Jacobs, DeForest Buckner, Kenny Pickett. All right, I'll take that for sure. Jermaine Johnson, Trey McBride, and then we got a Kyle Pitts. And it's actually kind of like for me from the videos that I've seen, um, it's kind of hard to tell the Genesis. Like, I guess the color is that kind of like a purplish, dark purple kind of thing. It's supposed to have more swirls. But I remember like seeing them, at least on the video, like you could barely tell. Like I couldn't really tell. Um, but that's a nice one. Jamar Chase. He still had a nice game in that loss. I feel like honestly, a lot of those calls were, uh, there were some rough calls against them that uh, shouldn't have been. But that is a really nice card. That pink camo. Max Crosby. Josh Allen. That's a beautiful, that's the national pride um, parallel with the pink. I love when they have these, uh, like the bang looks really nice with, uh, the different, uh, color ones too. The regular bang, not quite as much, but then with, um, you know, the, the different parallels for it, um, it looks awesome. And this looks really cool too, uh, the pink. And then we got a hall of fame, Peyton Manning, and then we got a silver, uh, Nick Bonito right there. Rookie. So some good rookies in there. Let's go ahead and open up the hanger pack. And I know for every game, there's tons of, you know, blown calls. Um, but I don't know. I just, you could say don't leave it in, uh, to the calls, but don't take the ball out of their hands too. Um, some calls are a little bit more egregious than others. All right, let's see what we got here. Nick Bosa, Matt Judon, Eddie George. We got a Zach Wilson National Pride. Michael Thomas, George Pickens, Robert Quinn, Fred Taylor, Justin Tucker, Kyle Hamilton, Fedarian Mathis, Jalen Naylor, Sam Howell. Again, those Brock Purdy cards, I think they're still holding their value. Um, I haven't heard back anything from how bad his injury is, but I hope he'll be okay. Um, I think he was really a spark plug for them. Um, so I think that also played into it for sure. Rashad Penny, Silver. And then we got these Orange. And Darius Leonard. Chase Claypool, no longer with the Steelers. Drake London. That's pretty cool, though. And then uh, Tyquan Thornton. So we got two Ricky uh, oranges right there. So definitely happy with the Drake London, especially. And then we get a bang um, right there for Najee. And again, for the, the parallels, like I feel like the regular bangs, they're okay. Uh, but when they have those, like, you know, the green or the different color parallels on the around the border, it just really pops. And then we got a touchdown masters of Jonathan Taylor, that old fat head. Makes you think of like uh, NBA Jam when you can have the, the big heads right there. Really cool design. And all right, we got the blaster. And we've got six packs in here with six cards per pack. So some good rookies uh, so far. And let's hope to continue on that rookie trend. And uh, let's see if we can pull something big. Uh, case hits, you know, Genesis, Honeycomb. I feel like I've seen so many people pull the Genesis cards. And so many people saying, oh, it's got to be lower than a case hit now. And I never pull them. So let's hopefully break that streak. Wish me luck. Trey Lance, I wonder what's going to happen with him, and Jimmy G for that matter. Jonathan Taylor, the National Pride, which I really dig that, that design. Terry Bradshaw, Matt Ryan, Kyle Hamilton, rookie. And we've got a Drew Locke. And then Kid Reporter card if you want that. All right, next pack.
Randy Moss. Straight cash, homie. We got some of the wrapper stuck to my finger right there. And Ryan Tannehill. Chris Olave. Hey, it's a debut, but I will take that. It's interesting because um, the debut cards don't seem to have as much value. At least that's what people say. But I think they're actually um, harder to pull than the standard rookies because the standard rookies are more common. That's what it seems like anyways. I don't know the exact um, odds, but from what I've seen. And we got Joey B. He got sacked a bunch. Um, a little bit more protection needed for him. And Juju. And then, yeah, this is what I was talking for, like, the parallels. Look how nice that looks. It's like a silver mosaic parallel for the bang Aaron Jones. That's a really cool shot, too. But I feel like that just pops so much more than the standard bang. All right. And we've got Kenny Galladay, Rashawn Slater, Warren Sapp, Justin Fields, National Pride, uh, Federian Mathis, and a Donald Driver. All right. And then again, uh, this kid reporter card if you want that code. This will be halfway through. I mean, again, we've got some good uh, rookies in here. Um, but, again, no big case hits. Najee. Brian Burns. Joe Montana. C.D. Lamb. And then Russell Wilson. Will DeWin. And then a touchdown masters, Joe Mixon. And the penultimate pack. No, doesn't look like another anything huge as far as case hit wise. Tua, Brandon Ayuk, Harold Landry, Michael Vick, Jalen Naylor, and we've got a Zamir White rookie. And then uh, kids reporter card. Last pack. Last pack magic. Ah, I shouldn't. I should stop peeking. Jacoby Myers, Dallas Goddard, Malik Willis, LT, and Eric Dickerson. That's a cool card, though. That mosaic. And then a Thunder Lane Dalvin Cook. I do like these Thunder Lane cards. I dig them. You know that little bit of like the smoke right there. You know, a little lightning bolt. But very cool. And let me know what you think of these. And let me know what you think my best card uh, was out of uh, these packs right here. And let me know what format you think did the best. The cello pack, the hanger, or the blaster. Again, this is a short sample size, but just from, you know, these right here. Let me know what you think. And let me know from what you've seen as well out there in the videos and box breaks and, you know, rips and stuff like that. You get a Kenny Pickett. Uh, again, the, everybody's looking for the Brock Purdy. I feel like the Brock Purdy card is SSP, super short print. Um, I've seen so many boxes and packs opened and not many pulled um but george pickens is a nice one too that josh allen the jamar chase but definitely let me know what you think my best hit was in these and let me know what your best hit has been too leave me all those comments down below and i hope everybody's doing well take care